This is exhausting. You've only carried in one box. That's one box too many. Where is Mary Louise? The only reason I didn't protest getting book fair duty was because I knew she'd do all the work. Seriously, I'm not unloading dick. Baby's orders. Everybody, shut up! I have finally figured out what my life stream is. To read at a third grade level? No, Deb. Patty Parakeet Breaks the Glass Ceiling? That's by C.F. Blinky. She's the guest author for this year's book fair. Her books are way feminist, and they teach girls about bending over. You mean leaning in? Yeah, same thing. I read her book this morning, and I was so inspired by it, and the fact that she was a featured friend on The Real Housewives of Potomac, that I have decided to be a children's author just like her. You're going to write a children's book? Yeah. They're like 20 words spread out over eight pages. I tweet the equivalent of 10 children's books a day. So what are you gonna write about? I don't know. Which is why I wanna talk to a professional like C.F. Blinky, who, by the way, is friends with Reese Witherspoon. Hey, guys. Sorry I'm tardy to the party. Mary Louise, what happened? Well, I pulled my erector spinet, reaching for a Sour Patch Kid that rolled under my car seat. Oh, crap. So you can't lift anything? Uh, would you feel better if you got to smell Chelsea's hair? Nah. It's her fifth day with dry shampoo. It won't be nice and fresh till another two. Not to worry, though. I called some movers to help us. They should be here any minute. Moving hunks? I thought they meant, like, hunks of furniture, hunks of trash, not hunks of... Medium oh. man muscle. Oh. Where did you find these guys? Pastor Ted recommended them. He said he uses them whenever he has to do any heavy lifting, and he's always rearranging the rectory. I have to go. Wait, you're not gonna stay around for a good eye bone? No. I am currently pursuing loftier goals than getting lost in chiseled abs, a tight butt, or how the muscles perfectly shape into that deep V right above that thick D. <gasps> Woo! <laughs> yeah. I sacrifice for my art. You look like a low-rent limo driver at O'Hare. Oh, I want to make C.F. Blinky feel taken care of from the moment she sets foot on Fillmore soil. Then why have you been eating the cookie bouquet the school got her? I sampled the product to make sure it was up to par. It is. Hi. I'm here for the book fair. See a Blinky in the house! <laughs> oh, my gosh. So nice to meet you. Chelsea Snap, huge fan. What's wrong with you? <laughs> Thank you. I'll take it from here, Mavis. That's Mavis. She sorts paper. Oh. I'll be your liaison while you're here. Is Brent in his office, Maves? No, but you can't... Great. Right this way, CF. <laughs>